Hello, today I want to show you how to use the command axis system. Let's imagine that uh, we have this, this pipe which we want to place some, some supports, some brackets. So let's imagine that we have those supports uh, nearly each 300 millimeters. So what uh, I'll be showing you is how to replicate those or supports just by using the tool axis system. So here is our initial support, which is really simple. Okay, and uh, what we have created here is a, a plane normal to the uh, pipe spine uh, line, okay, which is this one. And uh, through this point, we created uh, those two lines in order here to create the axis system that we need initially okay which is this bottom i will press here this will be our origin and i will select the two axes x and z okay so i'll be creating those additional points uh, a set maybe 300 or 500 millimeters let's make this new I will say it 300 millimeters well it seems to be really close so I will increase the, the value 500 okay yeah. this is for support 2 and I will copy and paste for support 3 let's say 1000 Okay, now I got those three points. Okay, now I will create a plane normal to the curve. Okay, through this point. Okay, and I will copy and paste it here. And we will say that the point is 12. Okay, now we've created. Now we're gonna create these uh, geometry lines. Okay point direction, let's say we wanted to make it an X component and uh, the support is this plane, important, okay I will do it, just copy and paste in order to replicate it through okay Just copy and paste, and we will say this has to be a Z direction. Okay, keeping the same, uh, the same support, the same plane. Same for this one. Okay, now we got. Now we got a. Uh, I created the geometry needed to apply the axis to these positions. Okay, so we're gonna create it. Really important to, to keep the same orientation as the uh, the axis from the reference of the support, this one, the initial one. Okay, so we're gonna click here to the origin. We're gonna click here. Okay. And just the last one. That's it. Okay, so now we got those three axes. That, as you can see, this pipe is not straight. It's having a bending, and it's important to place those axes in order to guarantee that uh, we have uh, placed properly this bracket. So what we will be doing is, uh, yeah, I will define where object is geometrical set. We'll come here to the transformation toolbar and we will click here to axis to axis. Okay, so uh, the element is this, the support, okay, that we created simply. This is our reference axis and this is our target. And that's it, here we have it. Then we can copy and we can do the same. We can put, 
we can place it here on super 3 and just by saying changing the target axis we're gonna have it here on our last super so here we have it we have easily replicated this component along this pipe keeping the specific conditions if we want to modify this support maybe uh, 20 or 80 millimeters move it uh, backwards or forward where we can click to the position point and just modify here the length for example let's say we want it on 180 millimeters 580 millimeters okay and that's it easily we can move it the component so thanks for watching